I decided after a while, uh, about two years ago, that I wanted to do a pretty in-depth study of this piece um, to understand it from a couple of different angles. Because I had complicated feelings about it and I wanted to understand um, first, how is this made? What parts of it are contributing to what emotions and how are those created? And then also doing master studies that were less literal but more like pushing this image through different processes to see what would come out. So that was the original sort of mission plan of the project. All of that was coming together and I liked that, you know, I was realistically painting light and shadow on this object that's both in the real world and not, both real and conceptual and is sort of hovering on the line between representation and abstraction, which is why a lot of the pieces in here too are you know, some are representational and some are more uh, abstract. I really want to understand how the physical measurable things are translated to the experiences and emotions and concepts that we share with each other as somebody who is making images. You know, I, I want to understand how they are linked and what pieces are, are translating in this way. And you see this fact value gap in a lot of fields. Like, um, we know that a certain group of light wavelengths will make us feel redness, but how do we talk about redness with each other? And so that's where even more of these topological <coughs> forms are coming in. I am now looking more closely to places where you see um, equations happening. This is like this. This is equal to this. Um, and in math, you see it in equations, but in, in the arts, you, can see, you see it often, I think most, in metaphor. So really, these pieces um, are looking really closely at metaphor and how metaphor can help um, make meaning. Well, he implies that the poet's job will be done when everything in the world has been compared to everything else in the world. And I love it, because I think it's true, and I also think it's great because that will never happen and you can make art forever. So um, that, that's really where this project is headed and, and why I've been doing it. So does anyone have any questions about <laughs> and, or about any piece in particular? Because I could talk specifically about um, anesthesia. 